Have you heard of the ancient Keyblade War? Yeah, the master's favorite story. My name is Jeremiahnator, everybody, and welcome to my top 10 Kingdom Hearts 3 worlds. Basically, this video is going to be a countdown of, pretty self-explanatory, my top 10 worlds that I want to see return slash be a newcomer in Kingdom Hearts 3. Let's get started. For number 10, I'd love to see a Marvel's Avengers or just straight up Marvel themed world considering Disney on their uh, TV network, Disney XD, makes three, no actually four different Marvel shows being Marvel's Avengers Assemble, Marvel's Ultimate Spider-Man, um, Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy, and Hulk and the Agents of Smash. There, one has to be represented in Kingdom Hearts 3, right? The ninth world that I want to see in Kingdom Hearts 3 would be definitely Disney and Pixar's upcoming movie coming out sometime in June, I think, Finding Dory. Now, be prepared, because on this list and on my honorable mentions list that I'm going to be showing, there is a lot of Pixar. But then again, Pixar being such a close thing to Disney, and considering we haven't seen any Pixar yet, just Disney, I think it's about time for Pixar to show up. So Finding Dory would definitely be a great world. And if they want to keep it under the sea, but don't want to bring back Atlantica, Finding Dory is the way to go, for sure. Monsters University. Yes, this is my number eight world, as I really, really loved Monsters Incorporated and the sequel, prequel type of thing, Monsters University. Both movies were great, but if they would like to go in order of their worlds, Monsters University is the way to go. The colorful world of the monsters would be so fun to explore, and I wouldn't mind seeing Sora, Donald, and Goofy turn into monsters and team up with Mike and Sully to maybe take down Fear Tech or something, or win the Scare Finals. It'd be pretty emotional and really fun in the end. Want something more colorful than even Monsters University and Monsters Incorporated? Inside Out's the way to go. Inside Out is Disney and Pixar's second newest film alongside The Good Dinosaur. And can I just say, I've only seen about half the movie, but oh my god, this movie was incredible. I loved it. And everyone has emotions, and considering these guys are in the Disney and hopefully soon Pixar worlds, we definitely should be seeing some sort of inside out thing going on somewhere. It could be like Timeless River, for example. It's not exactly a complete main part of the story, but it's still a fun place to explore, and I'd love to be able to go inside someone's head and just explore the different personality islands. Like, for an example, in the movie Inside Out, Riley has different personality islands, one of them including something called Hockey Island, and I'd love to see Sora's emotion islands. Maybe we could have like a Riku and Kyrie Island, or maybe even a Destiny Islands itself, and then like an Exploration Islands. You get the idea, just something inside out. I'd love to hear something about emotions and then travel inside someone's head. It'd be great. My number six world would definitely, definitely, without a doubt, be Lilo and Stitch. Now, Lilo and Stitch have been represented in um, Kingdom Hearts for some while now, we've had Stitch as a summon in Kingdom Hearts 2, and we even had a sort of uh, Stitch-themed Stitch world, really, of like space in Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep, but we've never had an actual Lilo and Stitch world. I really, really love Lilo and Stitch. I even have, um, when I went on vacation one time to Disney World, um, I actually got a gigantic stuffed Stitch, and it sits in my room every day, so I'm a pretty big fan of Lilo and Stitch. Stitch is actually one of my favorite all-time Disney characters, so I don't know why Lilo and Stitch hasn't officially been represented in Kingdom Hearts yet. Make it happen, Disney and Square. I want to see Lilo and Stitch. And with that, I leave you at the halfway mark of the video. Now, I've decided I'm going to split this video in half because otherwise it'd be a little too long with the other content of worlds that I'm going over. So without further ado, this video is over, but don't worry, I'm working on the second part where I'll give you the final five and my honorable mentions. Till then, I'll see you guys next time, and thank you for watching.